What is it? Who is it? I'm sorry. Benny? I'm leaving. Yeah. What are you doing in here? I'm just looking for my flashlight. It's not in here. You woke me up. I don't have your flashlight. <clears throat> you borrowed it. When? Last night you promised to give it back, but you didn't. Okay, I forgot. I'm sorry. Do you have to have it now? Yes. Ah. Uh. What are you wrecking? Just some stuff. Do you know where my flashlight is? <sighs> Here, I'll turn the light on. <sighs> here it is. It's right here. <clears throat> here. It's two o'clock in the morning. Is it snack time? What are you doing awake? I think I fell out of bed. Why didn't you just get back in? Because I couldn't find my flashlight. You don't need a flashlight. All you got to do is open your eyes a little. You got a nightlight you can do homework by. I like having my flashlight nearby in case the electricity gets blanked out in a thunderstorm. I see. Well, I suppose that's a decent reason. <sighs> Every child needs a flashlight. Bernie? Yes. I suppose that is true. <laughs> oh. Especially if you're camping. You could die without a flashlight. Have you forgotten what time it is? I heard about this guy who was camping in a swamp and he was in his tent and alligators came crawling up out of the water for their supper and thanks to his flashlight he blinded their eyes and he left. Uh-huh. It's true, it happened to Roger's uncle. Uh-huh. But Roger is short one uncle. He is? Yeah, he had other uncle who was traveling through a swamp and he Stepped on some mud and it sucked him right down. They never found him. My, my. Just his hat. Chilling. Will you be going to bed sometime soon? Will you? No. Got any bear stories? Well, you got your flashlight now, so why don't you, just the two of you, run along? Do you think Roger's uncle really sank down in the mud? No. I don't either. Don't shine that thing in your eyes. I see spots. Hey, there's a big spot where your face should be. Is that weird? Benny, that's not good for your eyes. Some flashlights shine for miles. Uh-huh. But mine shines just as far as I need to see. Remember up at the cabin I was walking on Randy Kunkel's dock and I turned it on just in the nick of time to see the end of the dock in one more step? was the end of the dock and the water was over my head. Yes, Benny, I remember. Want to go to bed now? If you wake up Mom and Dad, there will be trouble. One little story? I have a story about flashlights. Good. God gives us flashlights. As we grow up and we walk on a path at night... Is this scary? Life is scary, yes. But the Bible is, the verses, lots of verses in the Bible are the flashlight God gives us to see where we are going. This is not a story, Bernie. Hush. I'm sorry, I'm not going to talk about guys sinking in the mud. Okay. Sometimes we worry and want to know the future, but God's flashlights shine only far enough ahead so we can walk safely. His light shines only as far ahead as we need to see. Yeah, so you see a pool of mud before it sucks you down. Sure, why not? 